Greetings, Namaste, Monsoon Biswa Karma here again at Deep Music. And yeah, if you have seen another video of Sigma, this is a sequel or prequel to that. And right now we're looking at a grand jumbo sized Sigma and a very near and dear to my heart, a parlor sized Sigma. Both of them offering a very good deal for the price. And just like I normally say, you cannot go wrong with these Sigma guitars, you know. I own them, have recorded with them multiple times and performed with them. They never give up on you. They are pretty sturdy built instruments. And yeah, just like I said, they don't give up on you. So today we'll check GZMSGE, this one. A pretty cool looking guitar, you know. And as clear as it is, you can completely see where the inspiration draws from and yeah sigma guys are not shying away from pulling inspirations from all around the place and this one's called double o m s e frankly speaking i'm a big fan of these size guitars parlor size guitars and you know these offer a really distinct kind of sound and right now in the video it might look like i'm not talking much about that but you'll see throughout the video how it plays out how it sounds but yeah my personal favorite if i had to name a personal favorite this would be the one the parlor variant is a pretty cool guitar to have on a get-go while you're traveling while you're looking for a guitar to just come around they are pretty bold sounding pretty thumpy and Pretty great for finger styles, blues, delta blues, and if you're just strumming around. On the other hand, the Grand Jumbo one is pretty mellow toned. It sort of falls in a darker hue section, but surprisingly has a really chimey top end. Compared to the parlor, it has a lower action and the neck is slightly thinner comfortable for people who are not used to the extra chunk in the neck but for whatever you're getting in the guitar and the kind of inspiration that it has from a certain G brand guitar you get all your money's worth and in my opinion much more even with the preamp it has you can go directly live and the preamp is pretty decent so yeah above average fit and finish like most of the Sigma guitars above average playability and for the price maybe unbeatable you be your own judge play it swing it around strum it and mention in the comments below if you have experienced these guitars before from whatever I can hear and maybe from whatever you are hearing from the YouTube these guitars sound pretty awesome If you don't want to break your bank account but still sound like a million bucks, the choice is pretty obvious.
so if you just like what you saw be sure to like subscribe put a comment below it really helps out with the youtube algorithm that they put out and if you don't like what you just saw i will do better what can i say cheers